tuned in, Queens. I'm John Stamp. And I'm Christina Walker. Welcome, Welcome to, to Studio Q. Q. We have another action-packed episode for you tonight, don't we, John? We absolutely do, and this time I mean it. You didn't mean it before? No. I've been a little iffy about the last couple episodes, to be honest, but this week's episode has my complete endorsement. Why? Because this week's episode is John Orama. Not only do I star in News Desk with you, I star in our creative segment, Pills. Well, I also I wrote it. Well, good for you, John. Thank you, I feel good. Anyways, Heather has once again hit the streets to talk to people. But not only is it a word on the street, it's art on the streets. It's Heather Christie for Wood on the Street, and we've got a different thing going on this week. We've got this blank canvas, and we're going to get you to write on it and really express yourself. Let's do it. So we're here with Alex. Alex, um, we've got this great assortment of ugly pens and pencils. Can you express yourself? We're going to make a nice little happy face here. And, uh, and we're going to make a nice little red heart, too, because you know what? I'm happy, and I heart people. Happiness. That is what I want to start the day off with. You want to add some sunshine to your canvas since you're not getting natural light? Nice. We'd like that. I really like that. Maybe some sunglasses. Do you think if the sun were a real person, he would wear aviators or the bug glass? I think he'd be blind. <laughs> Next cup winner is... Buffalo. I could go for being somewhere where there's palm trees right now. Wicked. Too. Yeah, that'd be Vacation. sweet. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty sweet. Is that a donkey? Or yes, a uh, donkey horse, horse kind of thing. That's a cloud. So we picked up a donkey, um, some apples, a bird, some iced tea, um, carousal for some reason. Yeah, it's turning fast becoming a work of art. Um, are these all University students work? Yeah, it sure is. <laughs> <laughs> sure is. Well, I like elephants. Okay, go for it, yeah. Just gotta get a nursing cross on there somewhere. <laughs> what inspired the heart? Um, I don't know how to draw very well, and it's very easy. Mine's a Christmas tree, because I like Christmas. Excellent. <laughs> yeah. And who says art can only be produced by the tortured artist? On a day like today, you'd think there'd be more guillotines showing up on this bad boy. But no, as we've found, the only thing to art is sunshine, rainbows, happiness, and holding hands. Heather Christie for Studio Q, back to the studio. Well, as a fine arts major, I can honestly say I can draw a lot better than those people. Really, John? Yes, but essentially I am a powerhouse of creative talent. I'm like a rough diamond that just needs a little bit of polishing. I'm like a demigod walking amongst a race of mortals. I'm like an AMS president walking through the J-Duck. But in the spirit of fairness, let's take a look at the drama department's fall major, the good woman of Szechuan. I'm not in it, but I'm sure it's mediocre. <laughs> 